It's a Zara haul. What's going on guys? I'm Charlene Madeline and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, we are doing, as you can tell, a Zara haul. And I'm really excited about it because Zara is like my favorite place to shop and I haven't gone into a Zara for... since the pandemic started. Basically, I think the last time I went to Zara was like January of this year, which is mind blowing. I'm gonna just grab this box because it's just a few things that I got. <sighs> okay, let us open this up, yes? I'm, oh, it comes so nice. I've actually never ordered anything from Zara online before. I've always gone to their store. So I never knew how it came packaged, but it looks like it's a PR box. Like I feel really important. I feel like VIP. So Lux, come on, come through. Okay, I have, look at how pretty it comes, like pre-packaged. I do appreciate that Zara's package came without any plastic, so no waste. Wait. Uh, I have a lot of browns in this package. This feels really good. Ooh, this is soft on the inside too. Ooh, yes. Even the trains like it. You hear them? They're like, dang girl, I see you. Okay, I need to try all this stuff on because I can't. Okay, so I'm starting with this pastel green. This is actually pastel green. Even though I matched the wall again. Sweatshirt, and I really like this. This is uh, in a size small. It's like a really high, thick turtleneck. So if you don't like turtlenecks, this is not for you. It has a really soft lining right here. Really comfortable, pretty simple. It's like a pretty good length, I'd say. I'm wearing high-waisted jeans right now and it hooks over it. So this is nice. It's got like a thick-ish kind of waistband, but it's not tight, which is interesting. It has a detail in the back, which I thought was actually in the front but it's not. The lining goes all the way up and then across. It kind of bothers me that it doesn't line up all the way. It's like here and then it's like, oh, just kidding. We're gonna be down here. And then just kidding, we're up here again. Personally, it kind of bothers me a little bit, but I don't hate it. It's cool. I match the wall. The soft material actually goes all the way to here. I, it's a little bit short, I feel, on my wrists. Um, okay, I'm obsessed with this. This is so pretty. This is their belted faux leather shirt. Ooh, yes. This, first of all, feels like butter. Feels so good. It's got a beautiful suede type thing going on in the inside. So good. The only downside is that the belt doesn't fit me. The holes just didn't, didn't line up. I was probably like around here. So I just had to belt it like as if it was like this. If I were to use this kind of belt, I'd probably just end up using my own to be honest, but this is, ooh, this is great. It's got buttons here, boom, button. I can do a roll action. Oh, two buttons, two buttons, roll. Can I roll? I don't think I can roll. I think that's a little crazy. No rolling, no rolling. But I did this. Yes. It's big enough where I can do this slouchy. Ooh, yes. This is so good. I love this so much. I'm so glad that I got this top. I was a little unsure, but when I saw it in the picture here, this model was selling it so much, even though she's like crashed over and more like, oh, like I don't get the effortless, like, oh, uh, you know, Zara, Zara's poses always make me crack up because they're always just, I don't care, but I'm beautiful. Yeah, it's got, it's got a pocket here. This gets an A++ for me and my books, guys. Next. All right, this is just a standard t-shirt, nothing too crazy about it. And it just says, I will carpet DM tomorrow. That is the motto for the rest of this year. Yeah, I think it was like 20 bucks. I got it in a size small. I wish I got it in a medium because it's a little bit tight underneath my armpits, which I don't like, but I think it's supposed to fit more snug, actually, now that I'm looking at it. But I just don't like this. And then you get the, the weird crease line situation here. And it's like, are you wearing your little sister's t-shirt? You need to take that off. I hate that. I like shirts with 
quotes on them and stuff, so. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. I feel like I need to tuck this in. <laughs> Hello, Grace Jones. How are you doing? All right, this top is trending. I'm gonna put my hair up. I'm gonna just call this the Grace Jones top because that's how I feel like everyone is looking these days with the shoulder pads. I'm gonna, wait, can I just like replicate Grace Jones right now? Strike the pose. Did I nail it? You know, I have pretty broad shoulders and I wasn't really sure. I felt like I was taking a chance on it. It's trending, you know? I feel like if this was a year ago, everyone would be like, what are you doing? This has grown on me more and more. I don't know. I definitely had a black bra with this or just no bra. You know, in a strange way, it almost feels like it's gonna fall off my shoulder. I feel like I need to check if it's there. Oh, shoulder pad, you there? You good? I feel like I'm gonna make for a really good photo. That's what I do think. Don't know if I'm gonna keep this bad boy though. I might keep it. I might keep, I don't know. We're gonna, I'm gonna decide at the end of this video what I'm gonna do with this top because I'm confused. I changed my pants because I'm gonna show the pants in a second, but wait, what is this? What is this? All right, I don't know what that is, but I do really like this top. It fits like a glove. This brown is really pretty. Okay, as I'm wearing it, the neck part is a little tight. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't mind turtlenecks. There's just, don't really like when the turtleneck is so tight where it feels uncomfortable. Maybe if I like tuck this in and obviously not with these pants because this is crazy, but this looks, this looks pretty dope. This is how the fabric looks up close and you can tell that you can see that it's two different materials from here to here, which I think helps with armpit fat, which is nice. It doesn't really hold you in all that much, but I think it covers a nice amount, makes it look a little bit more seamless. I think that's what makes the top look so good. I gotta show you guys the pants soon, but that's coming, it's a surprise. Okay, this top, mixed feelings. Love the color, the style. I think it's so unique. I almost feel like I am wearing gloves with a top. Dislike, this is kind of like my only range of motion. As far as I can really go, before it gets really weird and awkward. And then I gotta do the whole pull down situation. This is a dinner top where you go in, it's a lot of these and then and you sit down and, and you eat your food. Then you leave and you take your little photo and you go home. But this is not a party outfit, I would say, or not a party top. If you're gonna do a lot of cheering, cheers, yeah, I feel like you might be in trouble. It also came in black. This is it up close. Again, another ribbed knit. I'm wearing the, the worst bra for this, so that's why there's like all these like bunching on the side. It's just too lazy to take it off. And it also has it in the back, so it goes down like regular straps. It's only crisscross right here, and then it goes straight on each side. You see that there? It's hard to hate it, but there's there's a lot of things that can be like. Look at this. What is this situation right here? I don't know if this is just cost from my bra. Okay, these are the first pants that I had on. Obviously this wouldn't be like an outfit or anything like that, but these are their faux leather joggers. They're cool. I've gotten their joggers before in the past. I don't know if this one would be my favorite, to be honest. The material doesn't really feel as soft as the previous ones that I've gotten. And I don't really like how this area looks. It's very bunchy. Maybe if I sized up, I got it in a size small. So maybe if I got it in medium, it would look a lot better. This. It's super tight, it's a little unbearable. It has pockets in the front, no pockets in the back, and a drawstring right here. So that way you can tie it to your desire. And uh, maybe if I lowered it a little, maybe I just have it too high. No, it still, still doesn't really work. Okay, these are their technical pants. They're literally called technical pants. These are cool, I guess. Uh, they're, they're, they're interesting. They kind of feel like I'm going skydiving a little bit. You can hear them too. In case you want to make a grand entrance. They're not my favorite, but they're interesting. They got a huge like balloon type of fact. I thought they looked really cool in the photo, just like a very lax look. I don't know if I like the length of them. They're a little bit too short on me. I don't know, it, it, it's, a, it's just not really working for me. They're really, really light. We've got a button in the front and an elastic actually in the back. So they're a little, they're very forgiving, which is cool. And then pockets. They got little pleats here too, which is kind of cool. So they're not bad, they're, they're really cool. I just don't know if they're for me. I don't know, I don't know if they're my style. 
I guess it's safe to say that these just don't fit, which is a pity because the length of them are amazing. But this is this area. Woo! I mean, I have, I'm, wow. This is just, <gasps> wait, wait, wait. No, I can't. These are amazing. If these fit, oh, they would look so so good. They kind of feel like raw denim. Even though these don't fit, I'm excited because I know that I can just size up and it will just work perfectly. It's such a pity because I had such high hopes. Also, I want to talk about this tank that I got. Well, it's a bodysuit and I love this bodysuit so much. I actually have it in white already and I knew that I needed to get it in black. It's, I mean, it's pretty classic, just a regular bodysuit. You literally can pair it with everything. I think this is like one of the best pieces that Zara has made so far. It comes in another color. It comes in a nude as well, but I'm gonna stay clear of the nude because nudes just don't work for me. Also, the material of it is very, very nice. It's pretty thick and yeah. This is so good. Oh my gosh. I feel like a chocolate marshmallow. This feels amazing. This is my favorite outfit. Out of everything that I got, this is my favorite. First of all, the material is so thick. It is like butter. It feels so nice. It feels luxe. It feels, it just feels great. I love the brown. This brown is so pretty. Again, Zara killed it with this brown. It's a really nice deep chocolate, but it's almost like a reddish, reddish tint to it. This has an elastic waistband, so it's very forgiving. It's got, again, that waistband type of, not material, but uh, situation going on right here. It gets a little bit tighter, a little bit more cinched, but it's not super tight. It's just a little bit enough to give you some frame and give you some shape so you can fold it over like this, or you can go underneath like that and it still looks really good. It stays up. It also has it on the wrists. It's it's great, guys. This is my favorite lounge piece that I've, I've gotten to date. And that's saying a lot because I love like Uniqlo pieces and stuff like that. I wear that those sweatpants religiously. The ankle has a great elastic around here as well. And it just, the bottoms just fit really nice. Both of these pieces in a size small. I like this because you can wear it at home to lounge, but if I also need to run out to like go run a random errand or something or go get something from the supermarket, I can just throw on a jacket or I can go out like this if it's not too cold. Um, it's just really chilly and I still look put together. All right guys, and that wraps up my video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I am in love with a lot of these pieces. It's gonna be really hard for me to choose which one's my favorite. I mean, this one that I have on, I don't know if I'm gonna actually take it off. <laughs> we'll see. I'm planning on doing an outfit haul with all the pieces that I got from this video, including the H&M one. So if you haven't seen that video, be sure to check it out and be sure to give me a thumbs up if you like this. Write some comments, let me know which outfits are your favorite. And until next time guys, see ya.